Friday, y'all. It's time Friday. to cook supper. It's Friday, that's right. We're getting ready to cook supper. It's not pizza night. <laughs> Kids had pizza last night. Me and Titus went and did a little bit of Christmas shopping and all, so they had pizza then. Tonight, we're having meatball. I don't know what to call these. They're gonna be like meatball subs. Sloppy meatball, sloppy meatball Joe sub. Sloppy Joe meatball sub. There's no meatball involved. We're not gonna shape them into the meatballs. I'm gonna do it faster and just make this like I was gonna be making spaghetti, only it's gonna be a little thicker than spaghetti. It's gonna be like a sloppy Joe thickness, but meatball slash spaghetti tasting. It's gonna be good, don't worry, it's gonna be good. I've got some of these deli rolls here. I also have regular hamburger buns if the kids don't wanna use the deli rolls. This is, Friday. it's Friday. <laughs> this is almost two and a half pounds of ground beef. Gotta get Manny something to drink real quick. We tried to go outside a little while ago, but once again, y'all, surprise, surprise, it's been raining off and on all day long. Yeah, you need some cheese. But yeah, it's been raining off and on again all day long, so it is so sloppy out there. Like, even when the rain stops, it's just so sloppy. I just made footprints. Yep, he makes footprints everywhere. <laughs> and anytime he slips, he gets covered in mud. All right, we've got that started. I'm gonna chop up an onion and some garlic. Right when I cut into this onion, I remembered that I had half of one in the refrigerator that I could have used, but that's okay. We're gonna use this half, and I'll put this half in there with the other half to make a hole. I'm gonna put a little bit of salt and pepper in here. Mom, why can't I use blister yet? A little blister? Yeah. Where's it at? Right here. That's like her yesterday. Oh. Oh, splinter. Yeah, I'll splinter. Do. Yeah, you had a little splinter and we got it out, huh? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Daddy got it out. Daddy got it out. What did you splinter with? Oh my god, and I cried. Okay, I cried. I need to turn my oven on because we're going to toast the deli rolls in here. We'll put in a little bit of garlic powder and some breadcrumbs. And I'm looking for some parsley. Y'all not have some fresh parsley. We got any parsley in there? Because I just started yapping. <laughs> I actually forgot I had this garlic over here. I'm gonna put that garlic powder in, but it's fine. Lots of garlic everywhere. Hmm? Huh? Why does he think about the floor? He's thinking about the floor? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, that is different. <laughs> okay, this is ready. Yesterday on the ground, I think, fell before. See, yesterday, I woke up that daddy, and he was a baby eating cheese. <laughs> yeah. Now we're going to put in the parsley, and I'm going to put a little bit of grated Parmesan before I add the sauce. So I'm pretty much making this just like I would if I was forming the meatballs, only we're not forming the meatballs. Now we'll put in the sauce. All right, now we're just gonna let this simmer while I get the rolls ready. We've got our melted butter. I'm gonna put just a little bit of garlic powder in here, like I said, just garlic is good. <laughs> we're gonna stir it around and now we'll brush it on. All right, so what we're gonna do now is take this mozzarella cheese, I just had this sliced mozzarella. I'm gonna break them in half. Okay. And we're gonna put them on the top and the bottom of each sub roll, okay? I'm gonna go one and a half. Yep, break it in half and we're gonna put them on the top and the bottom. Oh yeah. I can't actually eat them. <laughs> oh my goodness, are you gonna be a comedian? Mm-hmm. When you grow up? I have the oven on at 350, so it's gonna warm the bottoms of them too, but I'm gonna switch it to broil when I put them in there. And we're just gonna melt this cheese. About two to three minutes in there should do it.
Okay, kitchen is clean. The meats, not ball subs were great. Yes, we're getting all our movie night supplies ready. We've got these pretzel rods right here. And we're gonna make some gingerbread cookies, but they're not gonna be gingerbread men. They're gonna be gingerbread mousse. This maybe can be a, a snowflake. You know what? I think all my Christmas cookie cutters are down in the shed still. We never brought that little box up, I think, that has all the Christmas cookie cutters in it. The pretzel rods, we're gonna cover them in chocolate. I have these white candy melts, red candy melts. These are just gonna be for decorating though, I think, unless somebody wants to do a white chocolate covered one. And I have some chocolate almond bar right here. Also, there's still some of those little Hershey's trees and stockings in there. First, we're gonna get the cookies made and get them in the oven. Softened butter going in the gingerbread bowl. We've already watched Home Alone too. I think this is gonna be a Christmas movie marathon. Who knows who will last? Who will be up with me? Um, yeah. In the end, <laughs> it's always me and Jonah, the last two standing. Here's the mess. Oh, I missed the egg action. There it is. Well, I've got news for you. I know you're waiting. Christmas is right here. Well, I've got news for you. I know you're waiting. Christmas is right here. Hold on. It's time for it to reappear. Who's you come out of it? <laughs> I'm over here on pretzel duty. The way to dip these pretzels is to take your chocolate, that you melted the chocolate almond bar. We're gonna pour it into this glass. They're out of frosting over there, y'all. Pause one second, I gotta make them some more frosting. All right, this is stirring that for me. We're gonna take the pretzel rods, and you just turn it up like that, and dip it around, and lay it on the wax paper or whatever, and then people can come over here and decorate it however they want it. I've heard on her sweetly singing all the plains and the mountains in reply, echoing their joyous strains. Gloria in excelsis Deo. y'all we're done decorating got everything cleaned up this is all that's left of the cookies they were eating those as they were decorating them so I think it's safe to say they like that gingerbread cookie mix and here are the pretzel rods I think they're so cute we're ready when everybody finishes getting ready for bed getting jammies on it's popcorn and movie time mm -hmm. 